All right, so hello everybody. Just another video of my favorite type of game mode in GeoGuessr, the Divers World 25k speedrun. Um, and funnily enough, just yesterday, another player, Blinky, uh, was uh, doing this on stream and actually beat my time of four minutes and got a, an amazing time of three minutes and 40 seconds. And so I'm gonna put the link to the highlight of the VOD in the description. Um, and I definitely recommend you check it out. Uh, his like pinpointing work sometimes is just amazing. Um, so yeah, but of course, after seeing that, I had to give myself a try as well to go for it again. And after just about an hour, I was able to get a really good seed, uh, which you'll see in the video, and um, yeah, be his time. And so yeah, now I'm gonna do a voiceover with explanations of the round. So. Let's get right into it. All right, so first round looks like Spain. And just looking if there's any street signs or anything. I go here, there's a Lidl. That's good to keep in mind when trying to pinpoint. And here we got some nice signs. So Barcelona is the big one. And then I also said Lleida, which is another fairly large town in the area over there. Um, and then I do see Cardona as well. And so I'm guessing we have to be in Solsona. It seems like it. And so now I'm just trying to get my bearings. It looks like we're leaving the town and then I do see the Lidl as well. So we gotta be just north over there. So quick one. And now we're in South Africa with those R numbers and landscape looks like near Lesotho. So South Africa is really good to get in uh, diverse world a lot of times because you have these signs right at the start. I was able to find Clarence near Lesotho and now based off the road angle that seemed to fit. So another really quick one and now we're on round three already. So here we got those red and white bollards which you find in Poland and then we got a town name Ulasek and I'm just gonna keep going because that town is probably too small. And so here we have some helpful stuff. So the MAZ over there uh, is the Mazovietsk or Masovian uh, Voivoda ship, which is this area near Warsaw. Um, and so we'd have to be in this area. There's Ostrov Mazovietska, and then the 60 as well. And then Vasevo is there as well. There's Vasevo on the map. So now going back. There's Ulasek, and then just checking, is there a road to north? No, nope. there was one to the south, so we have to be just there. All right, here, uh, it was really quick, but you could just make out it said NC dot, so North Carolina Department of Transportation, and then ferry info as well. And over here it says Fort Fisher Southport Ferry, so probably somewhere on the coast in North Carolina, try to look for Southport and Fort Fisher. And so I'm just trying to look here. I thought we would be probably in this area. It seems most likely. I go here, just to check if there's anything else. Same thing, Fort Fisher to Southport. And yeah, I just gotta look for those towns, I guess. Can't really find them yet. And there's Southport right down there. So a bit farther south than I, get, I expected. I guess it makes sense with Southport. Try to look for Fort Fisher. There's an the aquarium, and then we were on this little curve bit. So yeah, we gotta be right there. All right, here we're in the Christmas Island. So um, we have that truck. We can kind of barely see the back of the truck over there. And then it seems like we might have a little path coming off to the south. And then our road, when we go southwest, it looks like it curves to the south. And then when we go northeast, it looks like it curves to the north. So trying to find something in that diagonal direction with a road to the south that fits. And it seems like this might fit over here. And so I just decided to guess because I was pretty short on time now, getting very close to that 3 minute 40 mark, so just guessed, and game breakdown, 3 minutes and 36 seconds, so just barely beat it by 4 minutes, um, but yeah, super hyped to have been able to beat it so quick, 
Um, I'm going to definitely have a go at it again, try and go even farther. Maybe try and go for Grannis's three minutes approximately time. Um, but yeah, definitely, definitely want to improve on this soon. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, and one more thing before I end the video, I just want to say that I have been streaming a little bit on Twitch. Um, I did, I think, two streams, and I really enjoyed them, and I might do another one this week. So if you guys are down to uh, see those uh, Twitch streams live, then make sure to give a follow. I'll put the link in the description. So yeah, until next time, I'll see you guys. Goodbye.